I thought about the Right Leadership Academy was it brought something, it brought a new perspective on some of the topics that we need and that we're familiar with. And what was most impressive about it was that it presents the information that has to be, that's critical right now in law enforcement to law enforcement leaders and law enforcement officers in a way that they're going to be able to uh, comprehend. It's a not a blame game. It's not something where you were trying to um, teach others that they're bad and, and some are good. Uh, for us, it's it. from what I got out of this was that um, it's gonna give the individual officer, the individual person, tools to work on themselves, to understand what's going on with themselves before they're dealing with others. One of the, the key things that, that I got out of this was that even though you may have a bad start, you had a bad day, you're low on the ladder, and you realize that your interaction's not going well, you can stop, you can rethink, you can apologize for how you just acted, or just correct yourself. It's not too late, you can always de-escalate. And so I think that's going to save a lot of jobs, it's gonna save a lot of, um, you know, blemishes in, in the law enforcement industry, and it's gonna help build community relationships. And so those emotions varied, and so I think being able to realize when you're off duty, if you're on the lower rungs of the ladder, that you have to pull yourself up, as long as you know you have to come back up, you find those things that bring you back up. In law enforcement right now, we are starving for um, a model that works, a model where our employees are going to be able to come in, they're going to be able to get something out of it, they're going to have a positive exchange, they're going to feel like they got a value add during that training. Uh, and so I think the, the Wright Academy model is exactly what law enforcement needs right now.